how y'all are. I'm glad for you to see me, I guarantee. I'm going to make you a roux. I'm going to talk about it. I've got it most made. And then we'll make a rabbit gumbo. Whew, and isn't that good? <laughs> hey, y'all. Today we're going to learn a few good cooking skills from a legend, Mr. Justin Wilson. So here we go, y'all. Sit back and enjoy. You ain't seen cooking like this, I guarantee you. Now what I'm going to do is put this in that. And I think I'd make it. Got to make it. All right, here we go. And we'll gradually stir that in there too. And if I see I need more water, I'll go get more water. I don't think I will need more though. Hmm. Oh boy. That's a beautiful roux, you know that? I'm telling you the truth. Proud to make a roux like that. You know, when you burn a roux, you just got to start over. That's all there is to it. Nothing you can do about it except start over. Boy, that's coming out of there just as clean and nice. <laughs> Bless your heart. You know, I like to cook with gas because I can control my fire much more better when I cook with gas than when I cook with Alex Trudy. I want to get all of that that I possibly can. I'm going to get it all. I'll tell you about making a roux. Let's go back to making a roux here, man. Uh, try to practice uh, making a roux by how it looks to you. One of the things we say frequently down where I used to live, we say it uh, get going good, and look, at it, look at your, get over your, your roux and look at it, and if you can see yourself in there like a mirror, your roux's done. Of course, you may want to brown a little bit more, you can do that too. Oh, the roux, let's get mixed up right. Let me get just something I need to hold that pot with. I ain't gonna hold it with my bare hand, I can tell you that. Hmm. Now, let's get to stir. We got to stir this roux pretty good. Oh, man. You see, he's acting all right. He's right. You can see that, can't you? Oh, boy, I love to do this. I got to tell you another story.